about the cost of food. Well, the cost in the Bay Area is up more than 10% than it was last year. And tonight, Mary O'Connell here talking to a local food bank that is now running out of room. The rising cost of living taking a toll on families all over the Tampa Bay area. Jackie Santiago is a mom of three boys. My husband and I, we both work. So, but things weren't getting there. It's just, you know, we're just barely getting by and barely making it. You could see some places you have to cut. So then you want to start cutting on food and stuff like that just to be able to pay the bills. She uses the United Food Bank of Plant City, telling me it's been a blessing. It has just been tremendous for me and my family. United Food Bank is seeing that growing demand. When I came six years ago to the United Food Bank, we were distributing 850,000 pounds of food a year. Now we're close to 4 million pounds of food. We were serving 1,200 people a month and that was going pretty smoothly. And then with the high inflation, COVID hit, um, and now we're serving over 11,000 people a month. Mary Hasek is the executive director. She tells me they outgrew their building years ago and can't sustain at this level in their current facility. So they're asking for support in their campaign for a new building. Now what we're going to do is tear this building down. We're going to move someplace temporarily and then we're going to rebuild right where we are at this building. It's a $5 million project and so far they've raised $1.6 Million. Hasek said they hope to be able to break ground at the end of June this year and be finished and moving into the new building by January 2024. I'm ecstatic to see what's going to come of this. An effort to make a greater difference in the community to better serve a growing need. In Plant City, Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News.